Hi everyone, welcome back to Little Owl Thrifter. Uh, I have more jewelry. Um, I want to thank those that have subscribed. I appreciate that very much. Just trying to get to 500 subscribers. I'm getting there little by little. <laughs> but I go on here because I love to show my jewelry. That's why I love to come on and... Uh, some of this jewelry this time around is for, from some church sales I went to and um, one of my favorite thrift stores that I go to. And so we'll just get started. So these were from, it was a church that was having not only a church sale, but a car show. So that was kind of cool. But um, I got this cool brooch, a butterfly brooch with the faux pearl. And uh, multicolor enamel there. I don't know if this guy was signed. Let me see. Let me look closer. Nope. But um, that was 50 cents. And then I found this new um, dragonfly brooch um, in the package. The little rhinestone touch there. And then this cool Mickey Mouse um, says Mickey stuff for kids. There's a vintage pin there by AAI. Mickey's all ready to have some fun in the sun <laughs> in Florida. Um, so this next bag was from a Methodist church uh bazaar i went to and they had some jewelry um i think all of this i'm showing now is total four dollars i think they're like one two dollars each this is a pretty uh handmade tree with the sequins just in time for christmas i can't believe christmas is next month already Thanksgiving's in, what, less than two weeks. <laughs> There's pretty green and red enamel wreath brooch. And then here's this cool Santa Claus. This uh, patriotic Santa. Um, snowman, I mean. Uh, I don't think that guy signed... Looks like something's there, but nope. But that's a cool patriotic snowman uh, brooch there. And then this dangle uh, tree. Didn't realize that one of the rhinestones was uh, actually two are missing. I wouldn't have gotten it. And um, oh well. But it's cute nonetheless. I think I have some rhinestones to replace it. It's just having the time to do it. And Sorry, guys. I just dropped my bag. Okay, so what is next here? Um, next, this was a community uh, sale we went to. They were all set up in like a parking lot. So this is a wood uh, cat brooch. And it is signed down there. I don't know what it says. It's A-P-E Appel. Cute. Cute, cute. And then this necklace has a toggle closure. And I think this was maybe Monet. Let's see. Uh, let me read it first and then I'll show you. It's marked here somewhere. I saw it. Yep. Monet right there. It says, uh, Monet right there. Very pretty. Has nice weight to it. Gold tone beads. Toggle closure. That was a pretty piece. I think these were like a dollar. And the people were from Connecticut, too. That's where I'm originally from. So it was fun talking to them. 
Um, this next piece is our tone. It's the Bone China uh, Made in England uh, flower. And it's signed right back there. Really pretty. I am on uh, Whatnot. I'm Purple Moon. That's my user ID on Whatnot, Purple Moon. Um, I have jewelry shows there. And then I'm also on eBay, uh, Lil L Thrifter. I sell on eBay. Um, you'll find some of these pieces there. But most of the time, um, I go on Whatnot and sell jewelry. This was so cute. This is JJ. Love the JJ brooches. Look at that. <laughs> Isn't that so unique and cool? I love that. JJ is a fun company. I love to see their brooches. This is another JJ playing with, the, I've had this one before, playing with the ball of yarn. And it says uh, JJ right back there. So cute. All right. So this was at one of my, the jewelry I'm showing next is um, from one of my favorite yard uh, thrift shops. And this is an Avon uh, cat brooch. I paid two for that. And it is uh, Avon there. And then, okay, so I saw this and I looked it, looked it, looked. Ugh. Spit it out, Lil. So I had my um, magnifying glass, and I saw that it was marked um, 925 here. Right there, that's marked um, 925. Well, this is 925, not this. This is magnetic, which means it is not, it's not a precious metal. It's not sterling. So that was disappointing. Cause I paid three for that and I wouldn't have done that. Um, that was my bad, but nice, you know, vintage chain bracelet. But I thought, you know, I found a sterling <laughs> and it was just the clasp that was uh nine, two, five. So what are you going to do? And then I found this, um, cute lucite type, uh, chain link necklace it is um adjustable there but really pretty with the silver tone touches i think that's silver tone sometimes it looks like gold tone sometimes it's silver tone but um look how pretty that is so that was a cool find and i found these earrings post earrings um let me see if they were signed here uh yeah they are all right let me just look and see what they say so these are napier 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 right back there it says it in there it's kind of hard to see but it's in there so these are posts they probably need some cleaning up back here but um, gold tone, I paid two for those. Um, usually people like Monet or Coro. Sometimes they want nappier, but not all the time. Um, this is really pretty. This one is signed. Um, this is a Sarah Coventry. There's Sarah. Isn't that pretty? Very pretty brooch. $2 for that one. And uh, let's see. I got this pretty clay glazed little angel with the heart. Um, I think maybe she was like a dollar. And then I found these fun Halloween earrings. These were at a yard sale. Those were a dollar. Uh, 
I don't. Hmm. Is that a mark? Nope, that's not marked, but aren't they cute? Those were 75 cents. <laughs> so those were cute. And then, um, I don't know if I showed this before. Let me take it out. Um, there's little earrings with it. I don't know. This was 50 cents. So here's the earrings. They're post earrings and they have like the, the like the Aurora Borealis. They feel cold. Here's your uh, barrel closure. Um, look how pretty they are. Really beautiful. And they come with those um, earrings. And next time I'm going to show um, another $6 bag. Here's a, these are kind of like a loose sight kind of earring. They are post pierced earrings. I think those are like a quarter. And, uh. I don't like to make the video too long. Um, what else? Did I have anything else over here? Just that bag. Um, I don't know if I ever showed these to you. I try to keep my pieces separate. I don't put them up for sale until I show them. Here's like a barrel clasp type closure. Um, these are like pink and white swirl like lucite type or acrylic um, necklace. I don't really remember how much I paid for those, but so pretty. So if I'm not back beforehand, I want to wish you all a happy Thanksgiving. Hope you all have a great holiday. And, um, you know, we're all thankful for certain things in our life, people. And, um, you know, you got to be grateful for the little things in life. I know things are tough all over, but I wish everyone a great holiday if I'm not back before Thanksgiving. And I'll see you later. Ciao.